This is Caillou Ninja News, or CNN for short, with your host, Caillou Ninja. Hey everybody, welcome back to Caillou Ninja News, or CNN for short, pronounced Caillou Ninja News. And don't forget, I am your host, Caillou Ninja, Caillou Ninja Weef, and and I am broadcasting my show at Caillou Ninja News Industries. Just kidding. Okay, in this week's news, Governor Lamont announced the state the state park beaches will be open in Memorial Day. Not sure if that's a good idea, but if you're going to go, remember social distancing. And that is still a thing, people. Remember, remember to wear a mask when you get outside. When you get outside. Stay six feet apart and you and only get really close to the people you know and live it with. Like your mother or your fathers, your your grand your grandfather your grandparents, your your uncles, your 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 the people that you know and the people that you know. And you are not supposed to meet up with other people yet. Things are not back to normal yet. Don't mess this up, or we'll be back where we started. Ay, ay, ay. That is going to be very unpleasant for most people. Just saying. In other news, that there's a company called TikTok, and they're making fun of, of people that have autism. That is bad news, people. Very bad news. Because... Because most of the kids have autism. No, that's right. I'm not like the only kid that has autism. Some kids don't speak. Some kids might be having issues with some of their body parts. But but we need to be fine with that. We gotta be normal about people. Even that even that people are different. Just because you can't see my autism doesn't mean it's not hard for me. Number kids, if if you if you watch one of those TikTok video videos, it's not right to make fun of of our of our of some people's autism or any disability. Autism tip. So let's talk about autism in a good way, the way it should be, with our autism tip correspondent Anton. Take it away, Anton. Thanks, Caillou. This is Anton, and we're going to talk a little bit about motivation. It's important that we have children's motivation to get them ready to learn so we can teach them really good skills. One way to do that is to find your child's favorite things. It could be stickers, uh, TV, breaks, books, games, things like that. And make sure you have all those things readily available so that you can show the child that if they do something, like write their name, they can get access to their favorite stuff. Thank you, Anton. Now it's time for some Oh Snap! An additional video that will cheer you up with entertainment, funniness, and, and, and most importantly, Jokes. Hello, I am Mrs. Caillou, and I got a joke for you. Why is six afraid of seven? Because seven, eight, nine. <laughs> <laughs> okay, did you know that Danbley's pu public library is super cool? I loved going there in the old days. But guess what? To, to be cool and safe, the library made its Facebook page even cooler with videos, virtual events, even the mini maker movies by made by their team. Listen up to my friend Aurelio introduce the super awesome trailer of his creation. Hi Kayo, this is Aurelio here from the Danbury Library and this is the video trailer I promised you about uh, episode 4 for Mini Maker Story Zone, which is going to premiere soon. Um, and be sure to check out all the digital resources that we have at the Danbury Library. And uh, don't forget to watch other programs that we have coming up, kids, like Lego Maniacs, Star Wars Bedtime Stories, and Mini Maker Story Zone. Thanks a lot.
Mario. That was amazing. Can't wait to watch it. This is the end of the show, everybody. And don't forget to subscribe to youtube.com slash c slash slash Ninja. Bye-bye now and see you in the next week's episode.